Hello and welcome to San Francisco, the beautiful city by the bay. My name is Dan Sotelo, Chief Concierge at the Intercontinental Mark Hopkins. I'm here to give you an insider's look into our beautiful city. One of the great things about staying at the Intercontinental Mark Hopkins is the variety of things that are available close by. Across the street is the Pacific Union Club. Grace Cathedral is a block away. One easy walk from the hotel is San Francisco's Cable Car Museum. It's free and you can uh, come down and see how the system actually works. Something else you can do that's uh, real close to the hotel is visit Chinatown, just a couple blocks away, right down California Street. If you're looking for the center of Chinatown, it's Grant Avenue, it's right here. You'll find all the big bazaars and all the main restaurants on the street. One of the great things about Chinatown is uh, having dim sum. You can go into the restaurant, just point at the carts as they roll by, and you know exactly what you're getting. If you like to go shopping, I have some great places for you. Let's go take a look. If you're looking for something uniquely San Francisco, check out Al's Attire on Grant Avenue. They specialize in beautiful, handmade, tailored clothes. For shopping close to the hotel, you can ride the cable car right down to Union Square. It's San Francisco's version of Fifth Avenue. One of my favorite spots is downtown here at the foot of the Transamerica building, the old Jackson Square neighborhood. You're going to find all kinds of old antique shops. If you're into that fine collector mode and looking for something special, I think you'll find it right here. As you know, San Francisco is a dining mecca. One of the things I like to uh, recommend is for people to come down to the Ferry Building. It's a location that's filled with uh, restaurants and shops related to food and gourmet items. Once you've indulged in all the uh, fine food inside, don't forget to come to the back side of the Ferry Building and enjoy the view of the Bay Bridge and the East Bay. One of the uh, signature restaurants here in San Francisco is the Tadish Grill. It is the oldest restaurant in San Francisco. One of my favorite dishes here at Tadish's is the Chopino. They do also some hangtown fries that you won't find anywhere else. And right next door to Tadish Grill is one of San Francisco's most prestigious and most difficult restaurants to get into, the Aqua Restaurant. One of the uh, signature dishes here at Aqua is the ahi tuna tartare. Bon appetit. Very good. My recommendation? is to call us early so we can make reservations for you. If you're looking to do something new in San Francisco, one of my favorite places is the North Beach. An amazing array of restaurants and cafes, a lot of cultural events. This church right behind me is well known because of the marriage of uh, Joe DiMaggio and Marilyn Monroe. It's St. Peter and Paul's, located right on Washington Square. If you're looking for a great cup of coffee, Try Cafe Trieste. It's sort of a historic place because in the back, Francis Ford Coppola wrote The Godfather. If you're in North Beach, it's definitely worth taking a hike up to Coit Tower. The views up here are spectacular. And don't forget to go inside and view the murals painted by Diego Rivera. And if you're feeling athletic, take the stairs. There's a lot. And if you're feeling adventurous, the best way to see San Francisco is to do it in the air. That's our insider's tour. Hope you enjoyed it. We look forward to seeing you at the Intercontinental Mark Hopkins, San Francisco.